What's up, everybody? It's the Asian video gamer here today. Um, playing a little bit different thing today. Uh, I'm gonna show like a Dark Souls uh, boss fight, the sewer fight. I'm pretty sure a lot of people already know how to beat this boss, but you know, I, I just want to demonstrate some parrying skills here because this boss at first is pretty hard, but once you know how to parry him, he's actually very, very easy. Like, pretty much like Lord Gwyn. <coughs> His combo is really hard to uh, parry. I don't know if you can, I never tried. But, there's one specific move that he's not doing right now. Oh, there he is. That, oh shit, I, I failed there. That's okay. Um, mind you, I already beaten like two bosses with this build before I come in here, and but my damage is still pretty bad. Also, I'm using the DLC weapon. Uh, you can actually use just use the mace, and it should be pretty much the same. You have to do that really a little bit earlier than what I did there, like before he, yeah, like that. You have to all. Like almost like as soon as he pause for just a second or less than a second, you have to swing, you have to parry then. The time frame is really low, but if you parry him, he leaves himself open for like super long. And his combo is really easy to dodge like that. Actually all of his stuff is really easy to dodge. So like this, he just stands there, telegraphs it really long. Like this is so easy to dodge. So if you're having problem, you gotta learn how to parry, not like me, getting hit in the face. Another thing that will help is fire bombs. Fire bombs deal a lot of damage on this guy, like 200. That's not bad. Otherwise, just keep wailing on him like that, and there's no special thing when you kill him here. He still drops his soul, he still drops his ring of blades, and if you kill him here, he won't show up at the other place. So there's not really any reason to go after him here. But it's funny how from soft said there's gonna be a boss that chases after you comes after you well this is the only boss that does that like unlike the trailer like they show like there's things that come out the woodwork like come out of the wall and chase after you uh that didn't really happen which is kind of disappointing in one one way i guess because i was kind of expecting them to uh implement a boss that would do that so right here, I'm just gonna just gonna take a minute. See, he just drops the soul and the ring of blades. So I guess you can get this ring of blades earlier. But that's it. So I'll see you guys next time. I'm working on a new video. Hopefully you stay tuned. Bye.